Hi there, this is J.P. Bailey. I'm the author of Emotional Freedom Techniques for Codependency Recovery. And I'd like to tell you a little bit about how EFT tapping can really help the recovery process for adult children and abuse survivors. You can use EFT as an emotional regulation tool just to help you with emotional upsets along the way. Just that alone is huge for people in recovery. It can help you get past mental blocks like limiting negative self-talk and negative self-beliefs so that you can clear the way to your personal power, to, which is like confidence and feeling courage and faith and, and more of a resourceful state of mind instead of these mental blocks that are holding you back. And I've actually really used these techniques. They're so powerful. They can really help you rewire that self-sabotage switch that seems to be operating in your brain when you're really stuck in unresolved traumatic issues. And it can really help you move forward. I mean, I think tapping, going along with any recovery program is, is like recovery on steroids, let's say really, really can save you years of um, struggle and pain. Now, uh, EFT tapping has been around since the, maybe the late, mid to late 1990s. It's been clinically proven over and over again in research studies. It's a technique based on acupuncture, which basically helps you to reduce stress in just a few minutes. It's like acupuncture for the emotions without the needles. And I really like the um, Association for Comprehensive Energy Psychology, where you can go visit to hear the latest on um, energy medicine, energy psychology, tapping, and uh, all the recent uh, clinically researched studies about it. Now, there's basically three easy steps to tapping. One, you have to identify an issue or a trigger or a feeling or an upset. You have to really be specific and identify what you want to tap on. Number two is then rate that stress on a scale of 1 to 10 of how stressful it is, how bad it feels, and 10 would be the worst. Okay, and then three is tap on the issue. So there's lots of different free diagrams and tap along videos online there's diagrams of my book um you just got to know what to tap on really feel it and tune into it give it a a, a sud scale of one to ten and then tap on it so you have to be mindful you know even write it down write a specific thing down give it a number tap on it and then rate it on a sud scale again so you can see that number going down when we talk about picking an issue to tap on, well, there's 500 tapping statements in my book to tap on for codependency. But in general, you're tapping on, you know, fears, anxieties, worries. Maybe it's anger, resentment, frustration, feeling revenge, feeling annoyed. Then maybe loss or grief, sadness, pain, love, pain, heartbroken. Or any self-doubt or confusion or overwhelm or feeling bewildered or confused or manipulated even. State the problem like a sentence. You know, just say, uh, for example, I'm scared to stand up for myself. Or that person makes me scared. That angry person scared me or whatever. Or I'm so pissed off because my boss yelled at me today or whatever it is. So be specific. Give it a title, a sentence, and then say how uh, stressful it is on a scale of 1 to 10. Maybe it's an 8, maybe it's a 6, whatever it is. Then just focus on the tapping. Just focus on the tapping. And when you're done tapping, then go back and try to make yourself upset about it again. If you still feel some upset, tap again. If not, then you're done. You're basically done tapping when you just don't feel upset or bothered anymore by that issue. So, anyway, that's, in a nutshell, a little bit about EFT tapping, and you can get my book free 
on my blog spot. It's a recoverytapping.blogspot.com. You can find me on Facebook. I'm JP Bailey MA. Um, and I have a page called Recovery Tapping there. But the quickest way to my book is hop on over to my blog spot, which is recoverytapping.blogspot.com. And uh, right here, you just put your email in that little box, and I email it to you automatically. It's already set up on automatic. So I hope you get a lot out of that. Um, I'm also had put in over 500 uh, positive recovery statements to tap in once you tap the negative stuff out. So I just wanted to let you know that and please pass it on to all your friends. You never know who might really need this and it could change someone's life. Hopefully yours and I'm sure for the better. It's changed mine and that's why I'm sharing it with you today. Thanks so much for listening. Take good care of yourself. Bye-bye now.